Hey guys, what is up? And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get split screen multitasking on any jailbroken iOS device running iOS 8.4 or earlier. This works on the latest iOS 8.4 jailbreak, so let's get started. So to get started, go ahead and open up Cydia on your jailbroken device. Once you've done that, you just want to wait for Cydia to load up. Once Cydia loads, tap on Sources, Edit in the top right, and Add in the top left. You need to add this source right here. So you need to go ahead and type this source in exactly like you see it here on my screen. It's ElijahAndAndrew.com forward slash repo forward slash. So once you've typed that in, go ahead and hit Add Source. It'll say Verifying URL. You just want to give it a second. Once it finishes verifying the URL, it will begin to install the source to your device. So you want to give that a few seconds to install. Once it's done installing, you'll see Return to Cydia at the bottom. And you want to go ahead and tap that and it'll bring you back to Cydia. So once you're done installing that, all you have to do now is go ahead and tap on Elijah and Andrew's Planet, tap on All Packages, and then go to Reach App. Once you do that, just tap install, confirm, and it'll begin to install on your device. So go ahead and wait for that. Once it's done installing, go ahead and tap restart springboard, and then you just want to wait for your device to finish restarting. Alright guys, so it's done installing on my device, and if I go ahead and unlock my device, all I have to do is install one more thing for this to work, and that is the jailbreak tweak activator. So you just need to install Activator. It's the exact same process we did for Reach App. So go ahead and search for Activator in the City of Search. And then you just want to go ahead and pick the Activator from the Big Boss repo. Go ahead and install that by tapping Install. And then once you've installed that, you are good to go. Now to actually get Reach App working and to be able to use multi-screen multitasking, all you have to do is go to where you installed Activator, tap on Activator, wait for it to open up. And now we need to set up a gesture within Activator to activate multi-screen multitasking. So to do that, all you have to do is go ahead and choose where you want the gesture to work. I'm going to go ahead and choose anywhere. And now I just want to select a gesture that I want to activate multi-screen multitasking. So I have a few options here, but I'm going to go ahead and scroll down until I see three finger print pinch. And I'm going to select that. You can use any gesture you want. And then you just want to scroll down to the bottom. Once you're at the bottom, scroll up a little ways until you see Activate Reachability. So once you've checkmarked that, you are good to go. Now all we have to do is go ahead and activate Reach App itself. So go into Settings on your device and then scroll down until you see all of your Cydia tweaks. Once you're there, you just want to go ahead and tap on Reach App and make sure it's enabled. So tap on Enabled and then you are good to go. So at this point, you are done, guys. That's how you get Reach App working. Now, to use multi-screen multitasking, I'm going to go ahead and do the three-finger pinch I set up. If you did a double-tap the clock or something like that, then you just do whatever gesture you set up. But I did three-finger pinch. So if I pinch the screen like that, as you can see, I have a list of my recent apps as well as all of my apps. So as you can see, you can scroll through your apps, and that's really cool, guys. I'm going to go ahead and open up Safari. And if I do that, as you can see, it splits the screen in half, and I now have settings on the bottom and Safari on the top. So it's a really cool tweet, guys, and that is pretty much it. That's how you use Reach App on your jailbroken device. Anyway, guys, if you're wondering how to do things like resize the window, it's as simple as using this little thing right here, and you can resize it doing by doing that. Um, the keyboard works fine, guys. When you tap on it, you can see the keyboard pops up just like that. You can type in whatever you want and it's really cool guys so that's how you use reach app on your jailbroken device that's pretty much it guys it is going to work better on newer devices such as the iphone 6 ipad air 2 especially the ipad air 2 with two gigs of ram it'll really take advantage of those two gigs instead of a single gigabyte now my iphone 5 is a bit old so it is a little bit slower on here but on newer devices it is going to run much faster so that's pretty much it guys you can use it just like normal if you want to cancel it and just go back to the single screen view all you have to do is you do the gesture you just did and that'll completely um, get rid of it or cancel it so it's as simple as that guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in my next video